healthy gets nourished. As the head provides its service, the body thrives. Through service, the whole body thrives and every part of the body thrives. So he saw that in his position as a servant, he had to choose. And he cho chose his service to, as a king, above his service as a husband. A difficult, difficult choice. He is Maryada. Maryada means exemplary behavior, conduct. Maryada is translated as honor, uh, appropriate behavior. He was Purushatam, the Uttama Purush, the highest exemplar of Maryada. We can learn. This is the verse today that he engaged in this way to teach us, to instruct us. So we can learn from many things from Ram. We can learn about his, his dedication to Dharma, but we can also learn about his his equal vision. A few days ago, someone was uh, commenting about uh, a conversation, apparently, I think it was, was it with Lakshman and Ram, or, or maybe, or Sugriva, or some, someone was, said, well, Ram, if you're, you're giving the kingdom of Lanka to Vibhishana, now what happens if Ravan shows up and surrenders to you. What will you do now? You've given away his kingdom. And then he said, well, I'll give him Ayodhya. And then he said, well, what will Bharat do? He said, well, I'll give him the spiritual Ayodhya, the Ayodhya, Vaikuntha Ayodhya. And what will you do? Oh, I'll be myself. <laughs> he had this, he was demonstrating, and there are many cases where he demonstrated, the, the, the beautiful one is in the construction of the bridge. Someone else, I think, told this in, in class when there was the, the bridge uh, construction and there was the story of the spider and the, uh, the, the squirrel or chipmunk. I don't know if you have that. Anyway, in America, they're called chipmunks. They're squirrels and chipmunks. <laughs> the ones with the three lines are chipmunks. Anyway, but... Uh, in India, I don't, I don't think I've seen American you know, gray squirrels. I've never seen any, anything like that here. But anyhow. Um, so Ram showed that they were equal. Hanuman and the monkeys are boulders, and they're doing their little part. But Ram saw them equally. So this balance, this equal vision, being able to be samadarshana, Said, uh, how does it go? Samak sarveshu bhuteshu mad bhaktim Boy, I'm really. Ah, the verse from Bhagavad Gita that ends Samak sarveshu bhuteshu mad bhaktim labate param na sochiti na kangchiti Brahma bhuta prasanatma. Brahma bhuta prasanatma. Na sochiti, na kangchiti, samak sarveshu bhuteshu, mad bhaktim labate param. To love Krishna, we have to love everyone. That is the underlying principle. Yes, there may be hierarchies, there may be differences, but we have to love everyone as parts and parcels of Krishna. Hare Krishna. Thank you, Hare Krishna. We have a few minutes if there's anyone who'd like to comment or
questions. Otherwise, you are all free to go. Hare Krishna. Yes, Prabhu. Oh, hey, Ridai, don't leave without your glasses. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna Prabhu, thank you very much for thank the nice you. class. Uh, you spoke about equal importance and equal respect um, and how to see um, like a Vaishnava gives respect even to an ant. So uh, we are taught to respect everybody even in an ant's body. Um, but Prabhupada also talks about ordinary respect and special respect. Um, in one of the purports, I cannot... Excuse me? Uh, Prabhupada also talks about ordinary respect. Ordinary and respect and special, and special respect. respect yeah. okay. Could you comment a little bit on that? Yes, yeah. This is the uh, quality of love. There's the basis of loving everyone. And then there's more love and great love. So in, in so many different categories, respect, love, service, uh, there are, again, there are hierarchies and there's equality. So there's an equality in the nature of the thing. It's all love. But there are hierarchies. So it's all respect. It's not that something is without any respect. Equally, everyone is respected, but one is respected a little more, another is even respected more, and then there's higher respect. So this balance of hierarchy of respect, love, service, and the equality, this is the, uh, the uh, gift of the Vedic system. And as long as we don't depart from the from respect and go to disrespect then we'll be okay we'll we'll be able to tread that path where yes there's special respect there's greater respect there's greater there's topmost respect <laughs> even Krishna's pastimes are like that there's sweet there's sweeter there's most sweet and there's the ultimate sweet so there's hierarchy there's gradations but there's also equality that answer your question Hare. Thank you very much. Hare Krishna. Jai Shri Prabhupada.